Hi, welcome to Lola's World. Today's tutorial is how to create a PayPal shipping label. You can do this without an invoice, order, sale, or eBay. Be sure to subscribe and tap the notification bell so you don't miss out when more videos are posted. The easiest and quickest way to create and print your own shipping label is to go to https colon slash slash www.paypal.com slash ship now. If you don't have an account, go ahead and create one. If you already have an account, go ahead and log in. From here, enter the shipping address of the person you're sending the item to. When you're done, click ship to this address. Options you have are to enter another origin zip code or keep it the same as the return address. You can enter an email note to your customer, for example. You can say, thank you for your purchase. Next, the shipping information allows you to choose either UPS or USPS. I'm going to select UPS for now. First, you would make sure your return address is correct. Then, select your preferred carrier. And I'm just gonna click UPS, and I don't have an account, so I will click no. But of course, if you do have a UPS account, once you click yes, it will have you enter the details to get you over to your account. Next is the printer type. Lastly, you would have to confirm that what you're shipping is not hazardous. Click continue. Since I don't have an account with UPS, I'll be asked to register and then I would fill out the info asked and continue. But for now, I'll continue on with the USPS example. If you want to ship USPS or United States Postal Service, make sure it's selected in the carrier section. Then choose your service type, the package type, and the package weight. You want to make sure to get this part accurate so you don't run the risk of your package being returned. If you do a lot of shipping, you can Find a postal weight scale and make sure you have the accuracy you need for your packages. After you enter your weight, you can choose if the package is irregular or has an odd shape. Tracking is automatically included. And if you need a signature, you can click for an additional fee and get a signature confirmation. And if you want to display the cost, you can do that also. You can also add insurance on your package. Once you've entered all your shipping information, you can look to the top right and click on Calculate Shipping Cost. You'll then get your total, select your payment method, and this would be either your PayPal balance or the cards you have on file. And then you can confirm and pay. On the next screen, you'll see your shipping summary. Scroll down and you'll find the tracking info. Click this and you'll be taken to the carrier site and as you can see here, it is USPS with the shipping status. When you're ready to print, come back to the print shipping label page and click print in the top right. You can either directly print your shipping label from here or you can download it as a PDF, document to print later. For now, I'll click download and the shipping label will then be saved to my computer. Next, I'll show you how to avoid a shipping label. Go to your PayPal summary page and look under recent activity on the bottom right. I'll go ahead and click on US Postal Service transactions and scroll down. You have the option to print details of the transaction for your records. You also have the option to void or reprint the label from here. I'll click on void and please note that you can only void a label if it has been less than 48 hours since the label was generated and if it has not already been used. You'll then be asked to select a reason why you want to avoid this label. You can also email this reason to the recipient. Then click on void label and you'll get a confirmation that you have voided the shipping label on PayPal's end. The refund won't be automatic and it can take up to 15 days except parcel select ground and media mail, which can take up to 21 days. Insurance costs will be refunded once USPS approves the label request. Well, thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Also, don't forget to like, 
share, subscribe, and check out the other videos on this channel.